This might look like the final stages of a normal traffic accident here in West Wichita, but what that truck hit made this so much more. Leave me alone! A simple request. Oh, get him off! But simply too much to ask. Friday morning, Latrell Thompson was in this truck when it smashed into another truck carrying seven beehives. I don't know, just a bunch of swarm of bees. Like, as soon as we hit it, we hit their home, so therefore they had a reason to attack us. So they start following us, really trying to get us, so we had to get in the car, but they'll get in the car too. So he ran, just like I ran when I got there, from the unrelenting bees. Even the firefighters, just there to help. This is all new. Uh, never made a call on bees before. We're constantly bugged. Missed me twice. Strike three. Yeah, it's it's been a uh, funny looking swatting match going on here with all the firefighters swatting bees and getting stung. Once the bees were free, putting them back is like putting toothpaste back in the tube. Yeah, I got stung in the face, in the back of the head, the neck, the hand before I got gloves on. So I know a couple of other guys got stung in the neck and the face. For the hour we were there, I was live on Facebook. Oh yeah, we're, this is definitely going on the news later today. Swatting and swiping. Anytime I run from them, they just follow. And trust me, I'm very, very fast. And convincing people driving by that today was not the day to drive with their windows down. I'd roll your window up, there are bees going around. Despite all of my close calls. Get out of my life, bee. I was never stung. Aaron Thompson, who's normally behind the camera, was not so lucky. Oh, did you just get stung in the face? Yeah. Oh man, he just got stung in the eye. Yeah, yeah, you've still got the stinger in there. Close your eye. Look at that. Can you see that? My eyes swollen at all. Even the tow truck driver could not do his job in peace. I just know. Bees got us. That's all I know. We just hit. We alive. <laughs> the damn bees. We alive. And that's that. Scott Evans, Eyewitness News.